Today's video is brought to you by... No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, my name is Nikki, and welcome back to another Killer Instinct guide video. Today we're going to be taking a look at something that we haven't seen in a long time in Killer Instinct. A safe counterbreaker. Now if you remember anything about Season 1, Season 2, or even the beginning of Season 3, you'll know that safe counterbreakers were very relevant in the meta of Killer Instinct. The game has been patched many times since then, and most of them have been removed but one very important one remains, and it belongs to arguably the strongest character in the game, Rash. Now before we get into the guide, please remember to like this video if you didn't know that any of this stuff was possible. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below, ring the bell for those sweet, sweet notifications, and subscribe for more Killer Instinct content. Now there are a few different ways to do this, and it always involves counterbreaking Wrecking Ball. You can do this meterlessly, with Shadow Meter, using instinct, mid-screen, or in the corner, it doesn't matter. Let's start with our mid-screen options. Using the back heavy punch stagger opener allows us to link into a light wrecking ball. Look at that pushback on that counterbreaker. Completely safe. Counter hit confirming a jumping heavy attack will allow Rash to connect a light or medium wrecking ball. Now let's use some instinct. Instinct cancelling Rash's back heavy punch gives him enough hit stun to jump backwards, let the bike continue the combo, and do a safe wrecking ball. Getting the counter breaker to function here is a little bit tricky. If the opponent is mashing combo breaker on frame 1, you will get a counter breaker combo. However, if they break on reaction, pushback will not allow you to confirm the counter breaker. This is still technically safe to do and there are no repercussions, you just miss out on damage. Let's take a look at both examples. Hello. The issue here is that the pushback sends Rash too far away to do anything. He can't even confirm it to Shadow Battering Ram. I've tried. It doesn't work. Now let's look at some of the corner stuff. So these are all pretty much the same setup as the way we do the mid-screen options. Using tools like Back Heavy Punch and Instinct Bike allow you to combo into Wrecking Ball. The good news is, doing this in the corner creates less pushback, which means you're more likely to be able to confirm your counter breakers this time. What? <laughs> that is absolutely absurd. 71% without any additional potential damage, just counter breaking an opener with instinct and two bars. If this isn't an indicator of how much broken stuff is actually left in this game, I don't know what is. Let me know if you thought this was useful in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Looking to become the best KI player you can possibly be? Head over to patreon.com slash ultratechuniversity today. I run a private Discord server that is filled with exclusive content that you won't find anywhere else. I host weekly lobbies where you can train with the best players in the world, and I run monthly tournaments with big crowdfunded prize pools. Make your pledge to Ultratech today. You know.